Hey, stop scrolling. Quick science lesson that can save you money and actually boost your energy and immunity. Ever looked at your supplement label and seen magnesium oxide versus zinc bisglycinate and wondered what the difference is? All right, simple. Chelated minerals are minerals bound to amino acids, the same building blocks your body uses to absorb and transport nutrients effectively. Let's use magnesium as our example. When magnesium is chelated, it's literally linked to amino acids, usually glycine. Think of it like this. Magnesium plus two glycine molecules equals magnesium bisglycinate. Bis just means two glycine molecules holding onto the magnesium. And this isn't just magnesium. We see the same idea with zinc bisglycinate, iron bisglycinate, chromium nicotinate glycinate, and others. So your gut looks at it and says, oh, this is food, bring it in. Result, better absorption, less stomach irritation, faster correction of deficiencies. Now compare that to oxide forms like magnesium oxide or zinc oxide. They're cheap, they look strong on the label, but most of it never gets absorbed. It just passes through your gut. Here's the memory trick. Chelate equals chauffeur. So, welcome to the gut club. Today, the bouncer is extra strict. Chelates? Think of chelated minerals like having a VIP chauffeur. They don't wait in line. They're escorted right into your cells. But oxide? They try to sneak in, but always get kicked out and just wander through your gut until your body flushes them. That's why magnesium oxide works better as a laxative. Duh. If you're correcting a deficiency, go chelated forms like magnesium glycinate or zinc bisglycinate. If you just want the cheapest thing on the shelf, sure, oxide, but don't expect much. If you learned something new, hit like and share it with someone who might need it. And if you want to check out some high quality chelated minerals, there's a link in the first comment.